What's up guys? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Hope you're having such a wonderful weekend. Today we're going to be working on the TSX. I want to lower it and then get new tires and get the alignment too. So that's what we're going to do in a bit. And we're going to go get our tires at Metroplex Wheels and Tires in Irving. I've seen a lot of good reviews and a bunch of my friends follow them on social media. So I'm going to hit them up. But first, I have to go inside the crib and grab some tools because I'm not sure if this car can get up a lift without taking off the lift. So, see you guys when I get to the tire shop. There it is, guys. Check it out. I decided to go with the 225 40s instead of the 215s because I don't really like the look where it's super, super stretched and I'm not gonna go really low. So, I just went with the 225 Nankang's NS 25s. Yeah, check that out. No more rubbing at all. But I'm really happy, guys. Shouts to Metroflex wheels and tires. We're hooking it up. Hey, what's up, man? What's up, boy? <laughs> yeah, shout out to Ahmed. If you guys need anything, tire mounts, tire balance, alignments, coilover installs, y'all hit up the boy Ahmed. Really hooked it up. Thank you, bro. Thank you so much, man. Oh, I wanted to tell you guys one more thing before we head home. One, I'm not rubbing anymore, so I'm pretty happy about that. And two, the front driver wheel is bent, like just a little bit. Yeah, it just sucks that I had to find out about that because. You know, I trusted the dude that traded me the wheels. Well, guys, that is just life. You win some, you lose some. It really do be like that. I'm not gonna let this bother me or make my day really bad. We're just gonna go home, cry a little bit, and then I'll get back to you guys when we lower the Tia Sexy. Also gonna get a fender roll too. See you guys in a bit. This is official. I'm doing a part out on the TSX. Just putting the stock suspension in the front. Nah, I'm just kidding guys. Right now I'm just taking off the diffusers and everything. I just want the car to look clean because when I slam it, the front lip is definitely gonna scrape. So this is a good idea that I take that off so I don't destroy the front lip. Oh, I'm so tired right now guys. Literally went upstairs to go do homework and stuff and then impulsively decided to take off my side skirts. And yeah, here we are now. Let me show you guys something really crazy. Could you guys imagine if I went this low in the rear? This is pretty crazy. It looks really good though, but I probably wouldn't do it. Oh, fuck. That was too fast. I think I did take a big L here. The car is looking kind of funny to me right now without everything on there. No front splitter or side splitters. I mean, it's clean. I'm sure when this thing goes lower, it's gonna look like really, really crazy, but as of now on this monster truck height, this ain't it, Chief. Ah, uh, just one more thing. I have the window visors mocked up. There's no 3M on these because I took it all off and I still need to put the new one on. We'll get these on soon. It's gonna look really good. Also, I wrapped the pillars right here. Remember it was chrome before and now it's all black. This was pretty hard to wrap. It required a big piece of vinyl and I messed up like two times. Well, that's gonna be it for me today. Sunlight is going down. So I'll just see you guys tomorrow when Hamid's at the crib and we're lowering the Tia Sexy. What's going on vlog? We're back and we're at Min's house. Say what's up bro. He's rocking that lifestyle too. It's a lifestyle. What's up? Right here. Nah, they ain't gonna follow you bro. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We are gonna be lowering maxing the Tia Sexy. The yeah, maxing it out. I feel like right here bro is the money, but you say we should chase max it out. Chase the money. Should we max it out chase or the chase the money bro? Cause I think right here is good. I think we should max out one side and see. All right, fine. We'll max it out on one side to see. See, these coilovers are pretty good because they haven't been seized yet. Function form type ones, I appreciate you. But these also ride like shit. I'm gonna get back to you guys when we got this all adjusted and we got the wheel on. Cause y'all know how to do this. Cause I record this a lot. Show them this shit, man. This thing's already tucking. Uh -oh. It's not even on the floor yet. This is how low I want to go with my Finman though. This thing's definitely going to rub. Just a little bit. But same as my old wheels. But I'm getting these rolled today too. You are? Yeah. Bomber B, baby. Drop that shit. That's not even all the way, dude. Yeah, we got to raise this for sure. This is what you call tucking. Holy shit, it's actually working. I mean, it just needs to keep... That's good as fuck. Perfect. Yo, that's good as fuck. Right, Holy shit. It. That's gonna rub, but it's good. Holy fuck. 
<laughs> this side's a lower. <laughs> it is? Yeah. This is why you guys need a ruler because you're gonna do shit like this. I was measuring it with my finger, like uh, to right here. I put tape on there and I guess I spinned it up a little bit too much. Good thing we got the rear done because that's the easiest part and there's not really much yet to undo. But now we're gonna tackle the fronts and get this thing lowered. But yeah, what do you guys think about that rear fitment? It's like way better. This is pretty low, look at that guys. Yeah, it is jacked up too, huh? On the front, so there's like more weight on there. Your headlights, your headlights aren't the GTR style that the TSXs are known for. <laughs> so I was on the Facebook forums and I just asked people like, what do you think about my tail lights? I mean, I know I'm asking for opinion, so hate is expected, but some people take things really seriously. Like, look, look at this message right here. This guy like speaking, I don't know, this dude speaking like a riddle or some shit, but... That's a philosopher, but... Yeah. <laughs> TSX philosopher. I mean, I know some of you guys say this is like an Audi style, like, oh, why would you get these and make your car look like an Audi? I got them because they look like Type S taillights and my favorite S2000 taillights. And I like it, so. Yeah, that's what it should be about, y'all. If you like it, get it. What's up, vlog? Damn, I really wish I could run this, guys, but fortunately, this shit is rubbing really bad. Like, the fender's about to get messed up. So I need to get that rolled or maybe more camber. This is what about a two-step real quick. Hey, it smells like some barbecue out here, dog. Them burnt cats, man. All right, um, once again, I'm going to fix the fronts. So, see you guys in a bit. Recording this, bro? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, come. On. Bro, you're. Holy shit. Wait, wait. Oh, fuck. Slow down. I don't know. What should we do? Bro, wait. <laughs> I don't know. Me, you screwed up. <laughs> you screwed up, bro. I don't know what to do. Ah. Hold on. Bro. All right, go. Just go. Just go. Full set. Damn. Damn. Man, what do you think about that? That scared the hell out of me. I just heard a laugh. No, it's because I didn't angle though. I, I thought that was something out. underneath the car, like you ran over like a fucking cinder block or some shit. Alright, fix facelift. Bro, you finally fixed your face. That's how it should be, bro. It's not a monster truck anymore. I need to, um, I'm gonna go put the front lip back on. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, put it on. It looks better with the splitter. I'll put the splitter back on. cinematic and rollers this thing is looking really nice but the front rubs really bad okay it's not like bad bad but like it just rubs and I had this problem before I should have went with the 215 40s but the dude was like oh man get the 225s so I got the 225s they probably didn't have the 215s in stock but I mean it looks good still like I don't really like too much poke and I need to throw back on the side skirt extensions and splitters so I'm gonna do that for the next video but that's it for today I'll see you guys tomorrow when we get defenders rolled. Damn, this thing kind of tucking in the rear, not gonna lie. Y'all, check out this black, minty, no cracked interior. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another day. It's been a pretty long time. Like, I got a haircut. I'm actually gonna go get defenders rolled today, and we're gonna go see Bomber B and see what he's up to. All right, so we are now at some random skate park in Irving. What's up, Bomber B? Say what's up, man. What's up guys? It's been a while since you guys seen him. Check out yeah. his car. This thing looks really different. I think last time you saw it, they didn't see the new wheels. No? Yeah. Well, let me show you the front end though. This thing's looking nice. But you already know what's going on today. We're gonna roll the rear fenders. Check this out right here. The fitment back here is pretty tight and I rub bad. But here are the fronts. I'm not gonna roll these. I don't want them to pull out more because they'll look kind of weird, but it's looking mint so far. Hey, say what's up to the vlog, man. Oh, man. <laughs> Yo, here ripping the gang, bro. Yes, sir. Bro, this is, bro, this is sick. Yo, you got a snap-on jack, dude? Oh, yeah. That's hella baller. Hell yeah. No Harbor Freight out here, guys. Bottom slip. Get out. 
Okay, bomber. So what are we doing to the TSXy right now? We gotta take these fender liners out. I'm trying to figure out how they come out. Okay, there's one on the side. Yo, that thing's huge. Mm -hmm. That's the biggest one I've seen. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> so right now we're gonna trim this off a little bit. Oh man, I'm rubbing pretty bad back here. Trash. Yeah, this looks crazy. Oh, that's it. That's it? That's messed out. Guys, I'm not exaggerating anything, but this dude literally rolled his fender in like 10 minutes, maybe even shorter. Dust it off for you, cuz. Thank you, man. I need to clean my car. <laughs> Bro, look, it's tucking now. That is tucking, tucking. Look at this. I could throw like a little spacer in there maybe. Yeah, you can get like a 10 millimeter spacer. 10 millimeter spacer? Yeah, or maybe five if you just want to close the gap a little bit. Oh, there goes the boy Kevin right there. What's up, Kevin? What's up? Dude, are you rocking the Art Gods merch? Yes, sir. Looking clean, dude. I thought it was gonna I be see cold. you, man. I thought it was gonna be cold today, so I wore this and then I sit in the car, I'm like burning hot. Yeah, it's pretty hot today. Good. All right, let's see your drop. I glide. Ooh, that fit, man, That's though. Fit me now. Yes, sir. Now, all I need for this car is uh, better specs. Okay. Angel, bro. Kevin. These wheels are pretty sunken in. I could run the spacer, but I'd rather just get better specs for the car. I know the pool is a little bit too extreme, and now this fitment looks kind of bad now, but I'd rather have bad fitment than my tires rubbing every five seconds, and now I can finally have people in the car. I love it. Thanks, man. <laughs> You're the man, bro. Thank you, yeah, man. man. Instagram at bomberp 14 and then Dynamic Auto Works also. I got a private meet. If you know how to get there, get there. And if y'all do apply to get in, just say y'all watch this video from Art God and then we'll let you in. There you go. And then I'm gonna take Art God for responsibility if anyone does a burnout. Hey, one more thing, one more thing. What's up? We're also gonna be at okay, Mondays Don't Suck. So I hope it doesn't yep. rain. For real. Yep. Yeah, we'll see you guys there. Y'all come right, through, hang out with Arashi. Well, that's gonna be the end of the vlog, guys. I hope you enjoyed the content. I'll see you guys on the next video. Enjoy the weekend. I'm gonna have fun editing this. Peace.